So this time of the year, these get the really pretty uh, purplish violet color. So I don't want to trim it off. That's why we trimmed it pretty. Um, we've, tri we've trimmed these pretty tight, tight uh, a few weeks ago. So uh, what I want to do is I'm just going to do a light topping just to get us through winter. But if I take all that violet off now, she won't have that violet again until um, spring. So we're going to save that. yard I'm just going to do a light very light clipping
some more, so I'm trying to trying to let it grow up some more. And you know we're gonna use the blower to clean it out a little bit. change the battery and you is that better you feel a little bit better now you got a nice fresh battery um, same rules apply I blew off first I'm gonna edge weed eat and then mow and we'll probably just bag up these clippings and stuff like that uh, got my yard and my neighbor's yard to do we're gonna do the third yard save a lawn save a life next weekend with the yard down the street where we did a backyard cleanup I'll link to that up here that's a pretty cool video uh, big transformation there uh, but yeah, we're just doing my two yards right now, the one down the street, and that's, that, that's, I did that one earlier, different video. <laughs> my yard and my neighbor's yard this um, three-in-one weed killer bonus s man it really did a number on these yards they look like shit because we have a lot of like weird shit in our yards and it's thinning that crap out needed to be done looks like poop you'll see what I mean my yards mode sort of mode because I um, ran it over with my big riding mower to prove to that guy that there was nothing wrong with it uh, but it's not I did it fast and it's choppy I'm gonna clean it up with my Honda <laughs>
So I know you guys are looking at me right now and you've probably have already commented or you're thinking of commenting, Dan, you look really tired. You look like you need a break. It's not that I'm tired. It's I'm greatly disappointed. Here it is. 3.30? 3.30? On Veterans Day. And I'm still waiting for my kids, my mother or my brother, to send a thanks. It's heartbreaking. Let me weed eat. This weed eater is kicking ass since I did the tune up.
you know, it's not that I expect like special treatment, but I mean, am I wrong? Like your own family, you know what I'm saying? Like your own family, your mother, your brother, your your kids through your ex-wife who doesn't support your kids thinking of their father on Veterans Day. I mean, my my son was born when I was in Iraq. I didn't meet him for four months. I don't. I don't think it's asking too much to, uh, you know, on Veterans Day. You know, I give up Thanksgiving. I give up Christmas for them so the kids can be with a lot of people and not just with me. But like Veterans Day, you know, that could be my day, you know. Thirteen and a half years, three tours to Iraq, tour to Germany. 1800 hours flying in Iraq. Ah, it's just disappointing. My kids deserve better. Back down there, I used the riding mower, so I'll just mow here and bag up all these leaves. We're going to cut a three inch full bag. Does look a lot better with the uh, Honda mower than the, the big old 54 inch Craftsman, huh? But I mean, in defense of the Craftsman, I was I was kind of hauling ass with the Craftsman, but look at all the dead stuff, man. That stuff really worked good.
does a good job bagging. Her backyard's a freaking disaster, so I'm gonna blow off this front yard and show you guys the finished product, and then I'm gonna spend about a half hour blowing off her backyard and mowing. I already weeded an edge, but I'm gonna blow it all, blow it out the back gate, and then when I go back there with the 42 inch Craftsman, uh, some night this week I'll run back there and cut it. Um, I'll chop those leaves up, but I'll be right back. And it's not like I'm not, it's not like I'm sitting here stewing, waiting for like my ex-wife to remind my kids to contact their father on Veterans Day. I've been, I've texted with my son a few times today. I sent him a couple video links from the toy channel about his bike, you know, letting him know this makes me feel close to you. I love you, miss you, you know, all that good stuff. Um, I asked him what they're doing today and then he didn't respond, so, you know. Heartbreaking. That's the old Troy build. It's going to the dump. Gonna send her to the dump. But it is. It's just it's heartbreaking. I mean what's what's a father supposed to do? What what more can a, a non custodial father do than what I do? Try to have a relationship with my kids, you know. I, you need help from the custodial parent, the mother. And you know I don't think I don't think the children are her priority. Because there's there's no excuse. There truly is no excuse, in my opinion. So, I don't know, especially on Mother's Day, she got balloons, card, candies, all types of candies. Stuff for her, stuff for the girls in the house, you know, her fiance's daughters. I mean, I loaded her up for Mother's Day through the kids, so it was a big celebration, you know. Whatever. So these came out pretty good. That doesn't look bad. Like I said, I'll do back there with the 42 inch Craftsman. Now that you, you know, once it's cut, a lot of that dead stuff don't look as dead because it, you know, what's grown up and died. And you have the grass growing down low, filling it in. So it looks a lot better, but it's hurting. But I mean, we needed to do it. I put down a really good dose of that stuff and it worked good. Doesn't this look nice right here? Oh, it's got some clippings up there. Doesn't this look good? Right here? Like driving in your car, passing here? It looks nice. The bushes are done up kind of nice. Nice enough. Can you guys see in the backyard? All the leaves back there? Oh god, it's gonna suck. Bushes look nice. Grass looks okay. 
I'm proud of these yards. So this one, save a lawn, save a life. We'll do this one next week. If you don't know what that means, uh, I'll try to link to it up above here. That looks good. She's got her nice little violet colors up there. Looks good. Not bad. And that Honda definitely saved the grass. That craftsman chopped it up pretty good. So you say, Dan, why did you sell the craftsman? Well, it's just too big. I mean, I got it for free. I put about 150 bucks into it, and I, I profited. Profited. I, I put it like 150, 160. I sold it for 700. Um, so you know, that's a profit of 550, and it purchased my mini bike to play with my kids. That's perfect. I, if I'm gonna get a large area mower, it's not gonna be a riding mower. You know, um, it'd be a walk behind, 36 inch hydro walk behind. If I were to get a large area mower. Um, I have that 42 inch to play around on, play around with, make some videos and do some, some things. But other than that, my Honda is badass. But anyways, happy Veterans Day. It's uh, 4.54 and I did not get a single call today. So I think at this point it's over. It's, uh, I mean, so like call me at this hour when uh, it's, you know, so I mean, that's just the way it is, guys. <laughs> that's why when you say, how do you do what you do? How do you do all these videos? It's because you guys are like my family, you know. Um, I can always count on you guys to comment, to cheer me up, to give me out of boys. A few wisecrackers tell me to F off, but that's okay. So... I always say, you guys got me through my divorce. You guys got me to where I am right now. Um, and so my loyalties to you guys in return, that's why I want to keep putting out videos, keep sharing my knowledge, keep trying to entertain you guys and inform you guys. It's, it's a perfect example why I have you. Uh, so you guys have me, like it or not. I'll see you guys on the next video. Tell me about the whistle. The whistle. Oh, 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 oh